Praise be Jesus Christ, many people throughout the world are having to self-isolate. A lot of us are going a little stir-crazy. Now, Proverbs chapter 4 says the beginning of wisdom is get wisdom. One of the great treasures in Christianity is the wisdom of the Desert Fathers. There's one of my favorite stories is the story of Abba Paul, who lived seven days from any other inhabitation, any other people. And yet he would do what the typical desert father would do. He would make three baskets a day. He would do basket weaving, make three baskets a day. And the typical desert father would be able to sell these baskets maybe once a month in a, in a market to get enough uh, money so that they could have daily bread and give some money to the poor. But Abba Paul was so far away from anyone else, he would spend the whole year making his three baskets a day, and at the end of the year, he'd take the baskets, put them in a pile, and burn them. And the reason he did this, check this out, he proved that unless a monk works with his hands, he would not survive a solitary life in the desert. Neither could he advance any higher in holiness. Though such work may not be necessary, do it for the cleansing of the heart, for disciplining thought, for perseverance in the solitary life, and for defeating boredom. Now, what you gotta do, and I'm trying to apply this in my own life, is find projects, even if they're not urgent, even if they're maybe even somewhat pointless, find projects so that you don't go stir crazy. Reorganize your kitchen completely. Reorganize, clean up your, your, your garage. Do that detailed cleaning of your car that you've dreamed of doing for the last five years. Find some projects so that you can uh, not go crazy. And as a Christian, try to do everything in the presence of God. And you will find great delight even in this time of trial. Viva Cristo Rey.